I'm here with John Bliss, president of the Greater Newburgh Symphony Orchestra, and Russell Gurr, his new musical director, who just won a competition to get the job. Gentlemen, how good to see you here today. Thanks for having us, Dave. Thank you, Jay. Tell me about how you got to this point. So a couple of years ago, I applied for the position. Being a conductor of an orchestra is like a marriage. It's all about chemistry at the end of the day. I felt it quite instantly that there was a great desire within the orchestra to grow, and they responded to my enthusiasm with their own enthusiasm, and so it feels like a very good match. when I was sitting in there listening to Pomp and Circumstance that over 42 years ago I walked across that stage and graduated and I haven't been back since so it was marvelous. It was like reliving it hearing that music. It was terrific. The first half he made eye contact with every single player in the orchestra and now I'm sure he's going to start all over again and make eye contact with all of us all over again. I speak to the audience from the stage which is not commonly done with all the big orchestras. This great Slavic uh, kind of dance tune, and then this wonderful, beautiful, rustic pastoral tune in the middle. So enjoy Dvorak's Slavonic dance, Opus 46, number eight. At the very, very end, when his head's in the thing, he has a last spectral vision of her, which you'll hear in the clarinet, and then, boom, off with his head, bounce, bounce, bounce. <laughs> Originally, it was the first of Elgar's pomp and circumstance marches, and you can't get much more English than they like pomp and circumstance. We had more than 100 candidates apply for the position. We had a committee of the orchestra. They selected four finalists, of which Russell was one. And the four finalists each conducted a full concert in Newburgh in our 2015 to 2016 season. It engendered a tremendous sense of excitement for the orchestra and the people because we asked every audience to rate the conductors as we asked the musicians to rate every conductor gave us a tremendous amount of data points for which to make a, a selection. The orchestra played absolutely fantastic and the most gratifying thing is that from the beginning of the week until the concert, the growth and the development was just exponential and the quality of the playing, the quality of the tone, the interaction between me and them bodes extremely, extremely well and positively for our future together. It has been many, many years since I've had a conductor make me personally want to work so hard to pull more out of myself than I've done in years. I've been listening to this orchestra for over 10 years. This is the most moving and musical of all that I've experienced. And I'm just so thrilled to have this new director here with us. <laughs> Reporting from Newburgh, Jay Berkey for HVNN.com.